Alright guys, you all wanna watch some TV? Yeah, Freddy, I wanna watch some TV. Okay guys, let's watch some TV. Uh. <sighs> okay, let me try again. Maybe I didn't press the button hard enough. Uh. <sighs> Wait a second guys, the remote's not working. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna try one last time. Uh. <sighs> guys, why isn't the remote working? Ah, <sighs> crap. Well, Freddy, if the remote's not working, we can always just play with the ball. No, Cupcake, we're gonna watch some TV. Well, Cupcake, maybe the batteries are just put in wrong. Yeah, maybe they are put in wrong. Well, I guess I'll fix them. I mean, they don't look like they're put in the right way, so, yeah, I'll fix them. You've been trained for this for all your life. Freddy, Freddy, don't distract him. Don't distract him. Okay. Oh, all right, guys, I did it. Cupcake, 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 man, you gotta put the, the back piece in now. Cupcake, no, I think it's the wrong way. <clears throat> Crap. Okay, guys, I did it. <sighs> okay, Cupcake, you're a hero. You'll be remembered forever for this. Yeah, Cupcake, now let's watch TV. <clears throat> okay, guys. <clears throat> so, what do you all want to watch? <clears throat> well, guys, how about we watch the news? So, <clears throat> okay, Freddy, let's see what's on the news. Breaking news! The Easter Bunny has just now announced that he will be quitting his job. Yes, you heard me right. The Easter Bunny will be quitting his job. So yeah, we will be interviewing him and asking him questions about why he's going to quit his job, and we will be the next Easter Bunny. So yeah, I'm going to go interview him right now. Okay, so it's the day before Easter, and I'm right here with the real, official Easter Bunny. So... I'm going to be interviewing him and asking him some questions about what it's like being the Easter Bunny. So, Mr. Easter Bunny, why are you going to quit your job? Well, you know, I'm kind of getting too old for this. I'm like 50 years old, and, you know, I've been doing this Easter Bunny job for 30 years, ever since I was 20. So, yeah, I'm kind of getting too old, and my bones are starting to ache, so yeah. Okay, so, Mr. Easter Bunny, who's going to be the new Easter Bunny since you're quitting? Well, I don't really know yet, since I have a lot of bunny relatives to choose from, and, yeah, just give me, uh, a little while to think. Okay, next question. Mr. Easter Bunny, what is it like being the Easter Bunny? Well, you know, it's pretty heartwarming to deliver all these candy and these eggs to the kids, and, but times have to change because my bones are starting to cramp and I'm getting too old for this, so I'll have to be uh getting a new easter bunny for this well that's all the questions i have for you mr easter bunny so this is the end of our interview and i'm gonna take my microphone back <sighs> hey guys did you know that that was my dad on the news bonnie your dad is the real easter bunny the real official easter bunny yeah freddy i never told you guys this because i've never whenever i was talking to you guys I never got on the subject of my dad, so, yeah. Wow, Bonnie, that's so cool. Yeah, Freddy, I think it's cool, too. Man, I really want to get some balls for Easter. Whoever the new Easter Bunny is, they better bring me some balls. Yeah, Cupcake, I know you have to have your balls for Easter. Yep, you got that right, Freddy. Man, I wonder who that could be. Uh, hey, Freddy. Uh, does Bonnie... Is Bonnie over here right now? That's my son. I need to talk to him for just a second. 
Uh, yeah, he's over here right now. Uh, but how do you know my name? Well, I'm the Easter Bunny. I know everyone's name because I come to their house and deliver Easter stuff for them every year. So, anyways, uh, I'm gonna come on in. Uh, he forgot to shut the door. Uh, okay, Easter Bunny, uh, what did you need to say to Bonnie? Well, what I needed to say to him is that I want him to become the new Easter Bunny, since he's, uh, my pick, and I want him to be the new Easter Bunny, so, yeah, he's young and swift, and, uh, I'm kinda getting old, so, yeah. Okay, Bonnie, so, uh, you'll have to be delivering the presents, I guess, at night. Yeah, Bonnie, uh, deliver the presents at night to all of the people of the world. Wow, Dad, I can't believe I'm the new Easter Bunny. I've always wanted to be the Easter Bunny for all my life. It sounds like a cool job. Bonnie, make sure to bring me some more plastic balls for Easter. Okay, Cupcake, I'll make sure to get you something ball-related this Easter. Okay, Bonnie, that sounds like a deal. Okay, I gotta go. Uh, see you all later. So, Bonnie, since you're my best friend, can you give me... Some extra stuff for this Easter. Yeah, Freddy. Well, anyways, uh, my dad has to give me some training about my new Easter Bunny job, so I'm gonna go back to my house, so. <clears throat> okay, see you later, Bonnie. Okay, Freddy. Okay. Oh man, nothing like watching a good episode of Days of Our Lives. Uh, Dad, did you say you'd have to give me some training for being the Easter Bunny? Uh, yeah, Bonnie, uh, I'm gonna give you some training, so you'll have to deliver all of these baskets to every house in the world. Uh, okay, that sounds good. Uh, traveling around the world is pretty good. I think it's gonna be pretty cool. Well, anyways, Bonnie... You'll have to, like, get all of this candy and jelly beans and eggs and stuff. So, yeah. Oh. Well, I have this big, giant bag that could fit 7 billion Easter baskets in it. Because that's how many people are in the world, and everyone around the world needs to get a present for this Easter. Oh, that makes sense. Well, Bonnie, that's all you need to know about being the Easter Bunny. Anyways, uh, I guess... Go play the Nintendo Switch in your bedroom. Uh, okay. And while you're doing that, I'm gonna watch this episode of Days of Our Lives. That's my favorite show. It's a really good soap opera. Well, anyways, I'm gonna go play Nintendo Switch. <clears throat> okay. Get back to this episode of Days of Our Lives. <sighs> Alright, Bonnie, come here. No, uh, it's the night time, so it's time for you to do your Easter Bunny stuff. Uh, okay, Dad, so, um, uh, so you want me to deliver all of those seven billion baskets? Yeah, and I have a magical backpack that can hold all of that. Let me go get it. Uh, okay, Dad. <sighs> Alright, Bonnie, so this right here is the magical backpack that can hold all seven billion of those baskets. What, Dad? How could that backpack hold 7 billion baskets? It doesn't look like it can hold that much. Well, the reason why is because it's a magical backpack. It regenerates baskets each time it gets empty. So yeah, it's like magic. Anytime the backpack gets empty, it regenerates more baskets. It was made by Bonnet, your sister, the machine maker. Oh, that makes sense now. Well, anyways... Here you go. Uh... So, goodbye. Okay, see you later, Dad. <sighs> Alright, Cupcake, so it's Easter morning. So, do you want to look at our Easter presents that Bonnie got us? Yeah, Freddy. That sounds fun. Okay, so, here's what Bonnie got me. So... <clears throat> Uh, Mario milk chocolate egg. And a Reese's Reese Bunny. Some Hershey Kisses.
two boxes of bunny peeps and and two eggs that are full of sour patch kids so cupcake what did you get well i got some Welch's fruit snacks some fun dip an airhead and my favorite a big gun that shoots out balls so cupcake you want to go outside and test out that gun yeah freddy <coughs> Okay, I'm coming. <laughs> Alright, Freddy, I'm gonna test out this gun. Okay, Cupcake. Okay. I got that pump action going on. Okay, Cupcake, that's all the balls. Okay, I'm gonna clean them up. Okay. 